Good morning. Thanks for joining me for Time for Truth. Just a reminder, uh, this video, the, the purpose of it uh, is to look at one small verse to learn the truth that it has and how we can live out that truth. Also connected with it or what it comes from is our larger Growing in Faith uh, reading schedule. Today in our reading schedule, we'll read Matthew chapter 24, the latter part of it. Uh, but today, verse 44 says this, Therefore, you also be ready, for the Son of Man is coming at an hour you do not expect. I want to encourage you to go back and look at September the 12th at PM Worship. The disciples asked Jesus two questions. When would he return and what would be the signs of that returning? Uh, chapters 24 and 25, he's answering those two questions. So we looked closely at when he's returning and uh, what are the things that'll help us know uh, signs that, that signifies that he's coming. Uh, but here really sums it up all very well and what we should do, that no one knows when he's coming. So we do not know what hour to expect his return. So therefore, we should be ready. That is a command. So learning the truth today, Jesus commanded uh, to be ready for his return because we do not know the specific time living out this truth. Live ready by simply following Jesus until his return. To, to not get bogged down and confused and every, with all the small details, just keep it simple. Be ready for his return by following him until he returns. Let's pray together. God, we do thank you so much for your great love for us and Lord, even answering the questions that we have, we want to know details and, and the intricacies of, of, of the big plan. Uh, but God, just thank you for reminding us to, to be watchful, to be ready until you do return. Lord, help us to live just simply following you each and every day. May we keep our eyes upon you as we live for you. It's in Jesus' name we pray, amen. God bless you. I love you. I look forward to our time as we learn God's word, and live his word out together. God bless.